Today's hearing for Markeith Lloyd started with the state asking for DNA samples from the defendant. In order to match his DNA against various items of evidence that have, were seized either by a search warrant or other legal reasons. Defense attorney Roger Whedon had no problem with that as long as he was present when it happened. But Markeith Lloyd, who's accused of gunning down his pregnant ex-girlfriend, Shade Dixon, in 2016, and Orlando police officer Deborah Clayton earlier this year, objected. Judge Frederick Loughton granted the motion for DNA samples. Next, the judge granted the state's motion to restrict certain materials to the public regarding the homicide of Lieutenant Deborah Clayton. Finally, the judge took up the defense's motion to appoint Miami attorney Terrence Lenneman as co-counsel. The defense says Lloyd trusts him. Roger Wheaton says trust is what's needed for Lloyd after being accused of murder in 1996, where the state ended up dropping the charges. Part of the reason for that was law enforcement, apparent manipulation of witnesses. So Mr. Lloyd's had some success with court-appointed counsel. I mean, to, to have a murder charge null prost is a, about as successful as you can be. But the key witness broke down, broke down in deposition and the investigator was paying him to lie on him. That, that's why I got no problem. He was being frank. That, the judge denied the defense's motion to appoint Lineman co-counsel. The court set a trial date of September 10th, 2018, involving the shooting death of Sade Dixon. I'm Gail Pascal Brown at the Orange County Courthouse for West 2 News.